Balcony at Willow Springs for Jimmy Up Matsuri 2018. Super excited um, to be here. Thanks, Jimmy Up. Guys, if you don't watch or subscribe to Jimmy Up TV, you're totally missing out on some of the best videos on YouTube. Can't wait to drive today. I'm not even driving my car. You're not, not even driving. driving. Yeah. Chuck's not even driving. He brings in his clothes trailer. Uh, he doesn't, he doesn't show up. It's ridiculous. That's true. You did bring the clothes trailer. Gary brought it for me. Oh, must be nice. It's going to be raining today. Uh, so the team is fully here. Gary is somewhere. We can't figure out why he never wants to be in front of the camera. It's a different layout today. It's going to be interesting because usually balcony, there's a line, and the layout for the balcony intersects itself. So you can only run one or two cars at a time. But the way Jimmy Up did it today is they're doing a Matsuri style layout where it can be constant constantly run. That being said, we have to kind of adapt to the new layout and it's a bit awkward and different. So it's gonna be interesting to try to feel out their track and, and learn it. So come watch us. Wow. Anyway, we're stay tuned. <laughs> anyway, we're excited for another awesome day of drifting. We'll see you out on track. Teddy, it's our run group. What are you doing? I'm trying to make sure my tent doesn't fly away. But what's the matter? It's you have the next 20 minutes. Yeah, but it could fly away in the next 20 minutes, Chuck. Yeah. I don't ever from the ring. I mean, you guys are screwed by yourself, but you know, I'm a palace. Your car's not even kitted yet. You're absolutely right, it's not. When's our run group? It's right now in one minute. Why do I do this? All this stupid prep work. Just to drive for like five minutes and then go home. Do you need help folding that? No. Don't help him! Oh, Why are you helping him? See how much there is. Are uh, you ready? Am I ready? Yeah. Let's see how slick it is out there. Show us how you put your helmet on. Dude, you know I have big cheeks, it's not nice. <laughs> what are you doing, Teddy? Do you need help? No. Unlike you, I don't need help. I can do stuff by myself. I saw the wobble. Wait, how did you come out? Oh, out? sorry. Drive down streets and see, you know, just drive up or down. That's the sound. Yeah. Drive shop? I think it's a drive shop. You have a jack here? Yeah. You have a jack? Oh, back there. It sounds like it's probably not 
shaft, but it sounds like a like the drive shaft underneath. That's probably the axle. Put a cotter pin. So the, easy, the easiest part of 
the easiest part. In the potter pin, okay. Right? So that, that was falling out. So lots of wobble, right? So then we tighten that, and it's still wobble. Yeah. And then we saw that the rack spacer is falling itself. outside of the rack. Lovely. Even though I had, I had thread locked it and cranked it, right. it's falling out. So there's that. So then we tighten that, and then okay. we were still wobbling. Right. Because now the tie rod inner is coming out of the rack spacer. Oh, nice. So basically everything was just falling out of everything. Oh, wow. It's fantastic. And is that because of whoever worked on it last? Well, John Ruiz is the one who did this last time. I don't know about that. Yeah, John, John was the one who did this. Oh, John's the one that tightened it? Yeah, John's the one who did this for me. Uh, was he also the one that did the oil change on your car last? Yeah. Yeah. No, because there'd be oil on the floor <laughs> well, otherwise. Yeah, oh, that's true. <laughs> Make sure you use that adjustable wrench correctly. YouTube might scrutinize the way you're doing it. It probably will. Dude, it's like it's like 20 threads loose. Like I don't even know how that happened. I'm surprised it didn't just come out. Well, it was about to. The wheel was wobbling like crazy. Everything was loose. The tire on space was loose. Halfway out. The tire on loose. Is that you, John? Teddy was actually saying you, that you tightened the tighten suspension these last. What, those guys? Did you tighten these ones last? <laughs> <laughs> God, Chuck. What? Is this what it feels like when I'm filming help? you? Is this what it feels you like when I'm filming help. you? Do you? No? Are you sure? Yep. Do you need a wrench? What? Do you need some wire cutters? Are you sure you're using that correctly? <laughs> I hate you guys! Do it for the content, bro. I hate you guys! I wonder, oh dude, it's so much toe out. Is it? Go well, under right there, do it. So what are you supposed to do now? Go home. No, you're such a win. Go home? Go down in there. Go down. I don't want to drive anymore. Go down. I don't even like driving. Go down. Uh, it's only three o'clock. Okay. Uh, I need a crescent wrench. Right here. And a snack. <laughs> oh, you just ate a burger. <laughs> Any Oreos? And cake. <laughs> oh, I need a milkshake. No, this one's too big. That's what she said. I need a smaller one. <laughs> I'm not cut out for this. It's not for me. I'm selling my car. Chuck, I'm selling my car. Someone give me an apple juice. Can you hurry up and fix it? We're running out of battery. Go up. Guys, that's a wrap for Jimmy Up Matsuri. It's raining cats and dogs. It's cold as hell. I'm ready to go home. But honestly, though, like it's pretty dope to have an event 
in the rain, right? I mean, like you, you right. get to like really practice right. technique, and it's awesome because you're not you're not using up tires. The driving is really slow, right. so it's not very dangerous. Right. And 800 big, horsepower, 800 KAs, horsepower, so you can tandem with KAs. Right. And the great thing is that because it's so slow, you can really focus on like your technique and like your footwork and all that good right. stuff, and right? So if you can't drift in the rain, you probably can't drift dry. Oh, that's pretty rude. Maybe. But you know, just oh, there you go. Jason, I'm going home. Hey, Jason, you want to be in our home. outro? You have to help yeah, us you have to clean the outro. Jason, what do you think about Ranger? Do you like it? It's great if you have a single cam KA. You should do it in a single cam KA. What about yeah. anything else? Actually, what? I what drove Gary's Jay Z, and that was also great. It evens out the playing field. You can drive with KA cars. Yes. And let's, KA cars see what, can drive uh, let's see what Mikey thinks about. I'm not even here Mikey. right now. So. Mikey, <laughs> the man, the myth, and the legend. Dude. Not at all. Thank you for throwing Jimmy up my Surrey. Thank you for coming. 2018, dude. You Thank rocked you. it. Nah, These guys are awesome. Here. Out yeah, of factory, dude. realize, man. Hey, you guys are the best. Realize TV is a bed shit on the internet. I mean. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Thank you. All right, guys. So let us know what you guys think about rain events. I know we posted kind of a little poll on our Instagram, and we got lots of good replies from you guys. But what do you guys think? Like, after seeing some of the footage from today, like rain drifting can be really fun. And despite the fact that it's wet and it's cold, dude, you get some awesome driving in. Head down to the comment section down below. Let us know what you guys think about rain drifting versus dry drifting. We gotta go help them clean up now. Oh, you're right. We gotta finish the outro, Chuck. All right. All right, guys, you know the drill as always. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that hit like button down below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you guys wanna see more awesome stuff from us. And there he is. We'll see you in the next one.